Hello everybody and welcome back to our channel. My name is Terrell. And my name is Brendan. And we are BNT Reacts. And today we are checking out Glee scenes that had me <laughs> screaming part two. This is by Denotable. Um, so we checked out the part one of the Glee scenes that had me screaming by Denotable. Um, Glee, Glee is just, y'all, I have Glee was a time. Glee you. was a time when it was on. It was, it is a time now that it is on. <laughs> Uh, but nonetheless, we definitely decided to check out these more moments. It's nice for us to sort of dive back into Glee. Um, kind of reminisce like, on these moments. I just... <laughs> let's, just, let's just get into this compilation. Oh, no. It's the shoe set. I don't know why they did this song. <laughs> this song was already terrible enough on its own. <laughs> yeah. Iconic, but terrible. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Fun, 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 fun. Looking for a human. What? Oh. <laughs> uh, I love Sue. Oh, the, oh God, I forgot. Oh. Yeah, when she joined. What happened? I don't remember when. This one, they had that fool fight, you remember? Oh, yeah, yeah. Rachel, look, Rachel was evil. <laughs> she was evil. <laughs> Girl, you're not even on a... Brittany, stop! She sound like she running out of air. Oh my god, I can't. <laughs> I don't know why they would match that together. <laughs> now performing the hit single uh -oh. Trick and also Talk by rapper Key Dollar Sign. Oh god, <laughs> I remember this. Just... New directions. This when they were drunk. Oh yeah. Yeah, this when they were drunk. Oh yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, that ain't oh, that ain't God. normal throw up. I don't know what. <laughs> They're just throwing up whatever they drink. Everybody drink responsibly. Stop, uh, Brittany. <laughs> I do not remember. Oh, I do this. This is CeeLo Green. No. Oh no. I remember this. <laughs> I think this when they um did the original song. This is the original song. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> why do I remember so much? I don't know why I, re I don't remember this. I love Mercedes. <laughs> Sit down. No, Sit no, down, Mr. Well, Shoes. No. no, I don't want nothing with Mr. Shoes in this combination. Sit down. What's your favorite song of all time? My headband. <laughs> This is my headband. I know. <laughs> God, Brittany, I love you so much. What are all the songs about? Stop, Brittany. They shady for putting this with that. Oh, Rip, Rip Naya, man. Rip Naya. Look, I'd really like to get my sweet lady kisses on, but I haven't been feeling very sexy lately. I think I have a bun in the oven. What? Oh god, yeah. yeah this I, is she thought she was Okay, especially Artie. Yeah, sure. She gonna tell everybody. <laughs> I love For Santana. Ready to get pregnant? Oh, congratulations! Oh, you can hear your girlfriend's Prado. You're gonna be a baby. <laughs> I love Lauren too. Oh, I love Lauren. How is it that you're now coaching a Glee Club? I was so inspired by my students in the Glee Club that I took the trip to Westvale and I volunteered my help. Unfortunately, the chipper homosexual who coaches oral intensity had a terrible fall down the stairs. <laughs> there ain't no terrible fall. Mm. <laughs> I love oh, Sue. I do too. I loved her. She was so good. Oh my god. That was a forceful push too though. Right. We'll be here when you get back. What? Who's with me?
Oh yeah, this is oh, I they tried to recreate the screen video. It was. We have to have a discussion and figure out what the God Squad feels about saving two gay people. Well, three of us are in Glee Club, so we pretty much sing to gay people all the time. <laughs> I know we're okay with it, but Joe may not be. I try my best not to judge anybody, but honestly, I've never met anyone who's gay. Oh, I guarantee you have. Yeah, they say one of the probably have. <laughs> You just don't know. Mm. What? I forgot she said that. <laughs> F uh, fan, oh my god. Fan, no. No, no fan. <laughs> R.I.P. to Corey too, though. Oh, I don't remember this. This one, I stopped watching it. I liked it. This is the new kids. I don't mind the new kids. I know that's unpopular. I know that's unpopular. Ew! Stop. Were... I didn't mind I her. her. I liked her. I liked her. And I, I liked you too. Liked, yeah, but other than Tina that, Tina got bad. Stop! Oh, I love this. This is one of my favorites. Make what official? No, they were dating. Mercedes. Uh, sorry, Mercedes, but I thought I made it very clear. I'm in love with someone else. Bitch, I can't. <laughs> not Rachel. Rachel? It was, no. No. Yes. Uh, For several years now. I love what she did. I this the song is so good, but. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, this is my song. <laughs> busted my window. You busted my window. you busted my heart. And this Quinn been in a wheelchair storyline. Oh my god. Go. Go, I've gotta go. Hold it right there, Sam Rex. You and I need to have a serious chat. Now I realize when I chose Becky as co-captain for the Cheerios, I might have rubbed you the wrong way, Mikey. And I've often <laughs> admired the craven heartlessness of your pointless, vindictive backstabbing. Kinda of takes me back to the old salad days. But you crossed the marginal line when you started messing with Sue Sylvester's family. What are you talking about? What family? You lodged a complaint about my teaching tactics with Principal Figgins, possibly derailing my bid for tenure just when I'm trying to have a baby. A baby? <laughs> Sue has some crazy storylines too, though. Yeah. Don't you? But her has worked because her character was so like outrageous. Yeah. How many upsides have Rachel, I know you're under a lot of pressure, but I need you to come with me. I love when they switch. I love this episode. Only one who can help. You want to run into your old pal Chandler? Far be it for me to stand in your way. We've been through this a million times. There's just a few text messages. Oh, hey there, Hobby. Yeah. I can't wait to hear so long as they come today. Hope you don't choke like you didn't hear me out of that vision. I hate <laughs> you. I'm putting more pressure on you, but we have nationals is the most important thing that will ever happen to me in my entire life. I mean, you'll basically be performing for every handicapable kid in the entire world. Mercedes? Mm. Even him at uh, Sue, I still, I'm sorry, I just, I can't. Oh, my <laughs> like, shoulders, Rachel Berry. Rachel, why don't you come up and show us what you got? Hey, Mr. Shea, can I have a couple days to think about it? 
Sure. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Is she looking at Kurt like, boy? Planning her wedding and whatnot. Give her your best when you're under pressure. Then turn around and show us how you're going to win us nationals. In other words, we're going to make out because your boobs look slightly bigger today for some reason. Okay. That storyline was trash, and I'm going to explain why. I'm going to explain why, too. They did a bad <laughs> Well, technically they... I mean, I'm not gonna say that. Because <laughs> they were, but like... What? what? Oh my god, yeah, I know. Are you serious? Yeah, the doctor called me... Oh, when he got awesome. chlamydia? Boy, you better be a dog. Just let her know, look. A tiny, greasy banana flavored wetsuit. No, Artie, okay, there's, there's no excuse that it's completely right. irresponsible. Mm -hmm. You have to wear one every time. Stop yelling. I'm sure he feels bad enough. No, Gwen, this isn't okay. Artie needs to be slush -shamed. I'm slush shaming you, Artie. You're lucky you just caught chlamydia. I mean, you could have caught something that can't be cured. Yeah, you could have gotten something pregnant. Just think about that. Slut. Slush shaming. <laughs> Sam is going in. Right? Yes. I take antibiotics for two weeks and then I go for a checkup to make sure it's cured. You have to tell a girl you slept with. Which one? What? Oh, God. Which one? <laughs> Artie was getting down. <laughs> I don't even know you. Sam, calm down. Artie, listen to us. You have to tell these girls that you have chlamydia. If you don't, you're going to put their health at risk. And they could be spreading it to others. It's the right thing to do. You owe it to us. Artie was... <laughs> This is like one of the first few episodes. This is day one of my favorite Kurt moments. <laughs> this totally stop. This was so inappropriate. <laughs> Look at her right there. Uh, <laughs> this is so inappropriate. I should be prom queen at this school. If I were yes, prom queen, I could get Brittany to drop the four eyed loser and go for the real queen. She's so gullible, I could convince her that by royal decree, I'd made her being with me the law of the land. <laughs> That's never gonna happen. I don't have the votes. Unless I could get the jock block. Jack Ryan, you've just bought the Red October. Sean Connery. <laughs> and God knows Sam doesn't have the heat at this school yet. Hold on, there's someone at this school who just might have the juice. Brofsky, <sighs> yeah. Brofsky. <laughs> Holy crap. I'm a closet lesbian and a judgmental bitch. <laughs> I have awesome gay guard. He ain't hiding either. I know. He ain't hiding that. Oh my gosh, Coach. Yeah. Oh, that Wait, you're serious? Finn? My eyes are still burning. I'm Finn Hudson, and I'd like to audition for the Cheerios. <laughs> oh no. Just stop. Just Finn, it wasn't for you. Dancing was not for you. Look at him back. He's just looking. Is this happening? This kitty is marvelous. Oh, yeah. I can't do this. You see Sandra Lowe from Rob Drag Race? Sandra Lowe. <laughs> That's a drag race tried to be. I don't like when shows do that though. Like they try to be. Sorry, y'all. That's the end of the video. I don't like when shows or like celebrities or artists like do or like just people like in a public eye do that. Like they, they try to be like a part of something or like seem like they're like supportive of something and they're like, hey, let's 
let's do this to show that we're inclusive of like the drag community or something. It's like, or like the um, LGBT community. It's like, you don't gotta do, or like, yeah, oh, you ain't like, gotta do that, that's not, that, that was so crazy to me. Um, I feel like Glee had nothing to prove because they yeah. already had like, they had so Kurt much diversity. Yeah, yeah, they, like, they, had, so they had so much diversity and inclusion and within itself. They didn't really have to do all this extra stuff to me. Um, but what did you think of this compilation? <laughs> oh my God. Every, I just, I feel like I block out all the negative things about the show and just like focus on the things that I like. So like when I watch things like this, it just brings up like the painful like yeah. plot lines that they just abandon. Oh, okay, okay. I don't remember I'm everything. To, I don't even remember everything. I'm going to try to defend my case. I know it's an unpopular opinion, but I don't mind the new people that they introduced. It's trash. It's I, trash. Marley, okay, Marley, they just, they just, they built her up so much. Like they made, I liked Kitty. I'm not gonna lie, she was she was interesting. And they made Kitty like give her an eating disorder and stuff and then they just like left it. They just like dropped, they were like, we don't care. Like, <laughs> yeah, we're dropping everything. And like Jake and that other white dude, yeah, they they were kind of annoying, strange, but. Strange. And I liked, I also think that Unique was like criminally, like she, like they, they literally like had a whole thing with her, like at the other and she was like, maybe I'll have to switch schools. And then she came to the new school and it was like, oh cool. She's now in the background. I'm like, okay. It but was just, I mean, it, it was just, it was trash to me. I don't care, but look, it was trash. The writing was just bad. The cast, it just, could have it done just, so much better. It just, I felt like they cast too quick. I felt like they were trying to like in a scramble just to hurry up and get like yeah. a new cast for season four. And it, it just did not go well. The characters did not go well together at all. Um, but nonetheless, I still love Glee though. And Glee also just, it also has some very iconic and funny moments, which I love. It's funny because even you said you only remember the good stuff. I remember everything. I remember everything, y'all. I, I, I remember see... the good and the bad because it, it's just like, it's, it's after over. I see them, I remember like the pain <laughs> of like all the. Like, I was laughing because I don't know how I remember the exact words Mercedes said. Probably because you I watched mine. I watched that clip so much because I really that is one of my favorite songs. Like Mercedes, it is a good song. Like, She's very ever on that entire show performed. That's one of my favorite. I love Mercedes' voice. So um, Amber I, Riley's voice. Oh my god, that girl. I still um, love when they switched when yeah. like when <laughs> Tina became Rachel like everybody that's just so funny. Real quick, let me also tell you why that Quinn in the wheelchair storyline was trash. It wasn't trash because, well, one, it was trash because they did try behind a wheelchair. It was more trash though the fact that she got up at prom. When she, when she won the prom queen all of a sudden, and now she can walk again and stand on her feet. Yeah. It was like it was like six episodes. It was like so quick. And it was like it was kind of like in a way like. It, like in a way it kind of offended me and I'm not even a handicapped person but it was like real people who are handicapped like don't have disabilities I'm sorry I know this is a show and all but we ain't gonna sit here and pretend like this girl can just get up and start walking again after she went prom queen. Like, it's not that no. easy. Like, it's not that convenient where they can just get up and walk again. And, like, that's why I, I didn't like when they were, like, doing them numbers, but, like, they were doing songs about, like, her being in a wheelchair and stuff like that. Because it just felt like it was convenient for them. And then she was like, all right, I'm gonna get up. And it was only convenient for her character. I don't know. I just, that wasn't rubbing me that's, the right way. That's just another plot line where I feel like they had so many good ideas, but then they kept trying to add so much that then they yeah. had to drop stuff. And that that's was another why, thing they just, like, they just, like, didn't. That's why. Like, that's why I think I really enjoyed Sue though, like throughout the entire series of her storylines, because no matter what, no matter what Sue's storylines were, they were crazy. Like Sue had, she was like Mary herself. Fun. She was trying to have a baby, like what? She was trying to have like do so much, so many crazy storylines, but it worked for her character. One because the actress was amazing at what she did, but also because her character was just like that kind of character. Yes. I felt like those crazy storylines could also work with like Brittany and like Brittany. How Brittany got like accepted into like the best school or something. Oh, she it was like, secretly a genius. Yeah, because it worked for because that was her type of character but it didn't work for all the characters and I wish they just got the message I feel like it, it also it only worked for characters where like they kept their like goals and motives the same like yeah. Sue always was trying to take down the Glee Club yeah. where like they started to shift everybody and then that's when it all got messy yeah. alright but enough of us talking we'll be talking for too long but alright John that is all for this reaction if you like it make sure you give it a thumbs up make sure you also hit that subscribe button and go ahead and comment down below for more reaction requests it can be more Glee moments or Glee compilations like this and we'll react to it and make sure to follow us on our social medias Instagram and Twitter yeah everybody let us know what moments in this big compilation or glee scenes that's had y'all screaming y'all but all right y'all that is all with this reaction and we're out bye